What's up guys? Today I'm going to be testing out if you can use a flap disc to make a distressed wooden flag. i uh, gotten a couple requests to do this video, so without further ado, let's get started. Alright, so I got my wood all cut out already. Uh, this is 1x2 and these are the furring strips. So these are the cheaper ones. They got the, the rounded edges on them, they don't have the squared off edges. And I'm just going to be doing uh, the continuous pieces for the tops. For some of my unions, I'll do the the uh, one by 12 and then cut it and then I'll have the shorter pieces over here. But these ones will continue straight through and I got two of these flap discs to try. Uh, one is 40 grit, the other one is 60 grit. They are the Diablo. Go ahead and just give you a look at them there. They're both the same version except one's 40 and one's 60. And I think these are only like seven bucks, maybe seven or eight bucks. So they're pretty cheap. And I will just be using my Dewalt angle grinder here. Um, I got my handle on it just to give it some extra support. I'm gonna go ahead and get the disc put on the grinder. I'm just gonna use the uh, 40 grit to start out. I think that one will work better just because it'll be a little bit rougher. All right, got that on there. And uh, usually, when I do the distressing on the flags, I will just come at it at like an angle and just go along the edge and then try and do some like varying depths. And then usually I'll just clamp it to the side of my table just so that it doesn't uh, try and run away from me. So I'll go ahead and see how this works. And uh, make sure that you wear safety glasses when you do this because uh, you don't want to get wood in your eye. All right, so uh, that seemed to work out pretty good. Uh, I don't know if you can tell, but got some really nice distress look on there. Uh, pretty much worked just as good as the other ways that I use work. So I guess the only question would be uh, how long before the disc would need to be replaced would kind of be the question. But I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of these uh, distressed so we can go ahead and finish up the flag and we can see how it looks overall. All right, so that is what it looks like all finished up. Uh, I think it turned out great. It's definitely something you could use for distressing the flags if you don't wanna go uh, any of the other routes that I've showed. Uh, I tried something a little different with the stars on this flag. I probably should have done the one piece union uh, for distressing, that's a lot easier. Just because then I was left with all of the grooves between all the stars, so uh, that was a little bit difficult. Uh, they turned out fine, but they're not the greatest. But overall, I think it turned out pretty good. Uh, let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, if you guys have any other video requests, I'd love to hear them down below. Uh, if you enjoyed the video, please like and subscribe. That would help me out a lot. Uh, thank you everybody so much for watching and please have a great day and happy new year.